The models are great, but with every model, when you do something and you have an action, you're now changing that data, right? Because I'm doing something because of what the model's telling me. So it would seem to me my results are different the longer I run that model. How do you address kind of that change that occurs through that process? Yeah, so, and that's a great point. And really what it comes down to is the game isn't the same everywhere. If you, if you think of it as a game, which, you know, it's kind of fun to do that. You know, seasonality is a huge factor, right? Places like Texas have a completely different, you know, climate than, say, New England. And then on the utility side, gas gets damaged. Underground gas gets damaged differently than underground fiber, right? And so that's why having more targeted data can lead to better predictions. But, you know, when it comes to intervening, what we refer to as intervening, Let's say you get a prediction in, and it says that, hey, this excavation has, has a relatively high probability for an incident. Well, hopefully you intervene on that to prevent that incident from occurring. That by itself changes the game a little bit. If you do that consistently, if you start intervening consistently into these high probability you know, risks, after a while, Things, you know, you change your baseline. And so you need to consistently stay on top of that. The word that we use for that in the, you know, in the AI space is drift. 